Yo to everybody, ASAP Dream here, here to give you a quick guide on how to play Cammy. If you could, please like and subscribe, that really helps me out. Alright, let's get right into it. Um, Cammy is a rushdown character and she thrives of being in your face and doing her throw loops. She really pressures her opponent and that's basically the gist of her. Alright, let's get into your strengths. Your strengths are you got some really good options to get in. You got this spinning back knuckle. It goes past projectiles and it basically gets your end. Plus, you're plus on block when you do it. So, do it at a distance to close in and now you're in. Uh, what you want to do when you're melee in is you want to get your pokes off. So, you want to get your, do your jabs into it or you can do your auto one. And the good thing about your auto one is it keeps you in front of your face. See? Right in front of their face. So that continue your pressure continue your throw loops and all that now when i say throw loops throw loops are each character has different ranges of throws so if i throw with a different character they're not going to be that close cammy when she throws she is close so this essentially lets you to continue to do throw loops which is very powerful in this game at the moment it could be patched out but right now it's really powerful all right, so your other strengths are, of course, take your auto one, your down medium, your uh, standing heavy, forward heavy, and then your down forward uh, heavy. Those are your really good pokes. And of course, your standing jab is really good too. That range is very deceptive. Um, all right, so let's get into your main strengths. What you want to really want to work on is cami is once you get in, you want to kind of start, find a way to stay in. And once you do your auto loops, you need to condition your opponent. Now, conditioning your opponent, I mean, get your throw loops off. And then what, the best way to do that is to set your opponent on um, wake up reversal. Go to wake up reversal, set them on normal throw. So that way when they wake up, they do a normal throw. And that will help you get the timing down of when you need to be throwing your throw out of when they're getting up. And then it will also help you with your shimmies. See? What I just did right there with the shimmy. I saw him miss the grab, move forward, go there. So can you move forward like a millisecond, back, and then you'll usually get your grab off. Like a millisecond, back, punish counter. Millisecond, back, punish counter. And then eventually you'll get good enough with this where you can eventually just get a full combo off of it every time. Eventually you'll get good enough to where you can do a combo on it. All it takes is just a lot of practice with that. Kami does some good damage and you just gotta practice with it. Oh, also another good button before I forget is your auto three. This is mainly one of your big tools, one of your big combo starters because you go forward while doing it and you can just Confirm it for so much stuff. It's really good. And now one thing I will tell you to do is um please do not be careful with your auto three because you can get drive impact if you just let it ride. Hold on, I gotta put her on block. Where are you at? There we go. Block all. Oh. See? So be careful when you do your auto three on block because there's nothing you can do about this. What I recommend, if you're gonna do your auto three, at least do this. So that way you're plus. Don't finish do auto two twice and then cannon strike. Cause that way if they do it, you're now safe. Versus just letting your auto three ride all the way out. So always do cannon strike. You see they block the first two? Can it fight? Always. Because I reset it back to normal. And with that being said, that's really it. I got that's all I got for Cammy. You just need to practice your um practice your throw loops. Practice your shimmies. And on auto three, do not let it ride out. Just always do that. And prepare to punish counter and practice your combos. And they got some really fun combos, <laughs> like really fun. So it's really good to practice it. Um, you can watch pros like Punk the God and steal some of their combos 
or I got a combo video if you want to watch it. And with that being said, that's really all I got. Please like, subscribe, and we out. Peace out,